Okay, I would like to show you um, the new Android keyboard from Android 4.2 installed on my Samsung Galaxy S3 4G. If we choose to make a Evernote note here and click here, um, so if I here is the new Android 4.2 keyboard with gesture typing so now we can do some gestures to type as you can see I type testing testing the new keyboard and as you can see uh, when you do the gesture the word is floating above your finger and well, that's nice freaky but I would like to type really so then I choose the word really instead and you see it changed to really and now you see the predictive uh, text comes here um, the keyboard suggests that I will type the word good or need or want after this so I can choose good now really good and then for two or day if I want so you see it predict words that it thinks I should type as next and that's nice I like this keyboard uh, but it's not as good when it comes to um, using more than one language I use both English and Swedish and then I have activated English and Swedish so I have a button down here to choose language so if we do a uh, enter there return and then we choose to type with Swedish instead we click on that globe and you see it changes to Swedish as you can see Swedish so now we could type in Swedish but then in this version um, it doesn't work with gestures see here as you can see it doesn't work with gestures and that's really bad really really bad I hope they fix that I can't do gesture typing in Swedish I can type with predictive text as you can see it predicts word for me So, gesture typing with another language than English doesn't work, and that's bad, really bad. So I prefer, I still prefer the new swipe beta, as we can show you now. Now I've changed to swipe beta keyboard and this keyboard supports both English and Swedish and many more languages so now I can type in English as you can see it uh, typed testing for me 
but you don't see a word floating above it when you swiping. That's the big difference between swipe and the new Android keyboard. But it predicts words. Not as good as the Android keyboard though. So testing swipe. Now I want to type in Swedish. I go down here and I can do a click on that button space and choose Swedish. So now I can do uh, gesture typing, swiping in Swedish. Sorry, <laughs> I did an English word. Uh, like that. And it works great. So that's the difference between the new Android keyboard and Swipe. Swipe is better with more languages. Uh, and Swipe also has uh, some characters on the same buttons as you can see. Uh, so it's easy to do different characters characters when typing. The new Android keyboard doesn't have that. As you can see here, this is the Android keyboard. You don't have any more characters more than these. The cool thing is that this keyboard works with uh, installing it on any phone that already runs uh, Android Jelly Bean. It works really great. Okay, that was the new Android keyboard from Android 4.2 installed on a Samsung Galaxy S3 4G. Bye.